June 26, 1936 marks a pivotal date in aviation history. On this day, the Fokker Wolf FW61 took to the skies, achieving what many thought impossible. It was not merely a flight, but the maiden voyage of the world's first truly practical helicopter. Previous attempts at vertical flight had been unstable and uncontrollable. The FW61, designed by Heinrich Fokker, revolutionized this concept. Its innovative twin rotor configuration, mounted on outriggers, provided unprecedented stability and maneuverability. This design allowed for controlled ascent, descent, and hovering. It demonstrated the potential for rotary wing aircraft beyond mere experimental curiosities. The FW61 proved that helicopters could be a viable form of transport and observation. The FW61's capabilities were famously showcased by test pilot Hannah Reich. Her skill brought the machine to public attention, performing daring maneuvers. She even flew it inside the Deutschland Halle in Berlin, astonishing spectators with its precision. The success of the FW61 laid the foundational groundwork for all future helicopter development. Its principles of control and stability influenced designs for decades to come. This pioneering aircraft truly opened the skies to vertical flight.